the new announcements that they've done today about user-defined functions. I'm really excited to see where that's going to take, you know, Fabric as a whole because there's so much you can do with it. It's, uh, I think what Amir said today was that it's basically sassifying uh, data functions, and that's very cool. That is incredibly cool. Now, you've got a number of incredible uh, uh, reports and analytics that you've done that integrate AI into Power BI. Today, we saw a number of incredible co-pilot integrations and new opportunities there. As you look at, at at the fabric and and the integration of Copilot, what are your thoughts on, on where people should be looking at and focusing? I'm really only excited about three different places that AI is coming to Power BI. The first one's obviously going to be DAX Core View and Timdal. When Copilot drops for those two things, it's going to do so much for, you know, it's like being able to write queries quickly, being able to, you know, it's like change the semantic model quickly. And, you know, um, Rui Romano has already shown us how it, with Visual Studio Code, you can do a lot of stuff. Right now, it's not directly integrated, so you've got to copy and paste things. And I, I don't always love to do that. 